Welcome back to Backcountry Amateur Radio. Now, you're probably wondering what you're about to see here, but maybe not. It is the Radiata GS5B programming cable solution. As you may know, when you connect your programming software to your radio via the device cable, programming cable, you, some people, not everyone, have seen this problem where it goes, the radio goes into transmit when you go to read or write the radio. And also, a lot of people have complained that it doesn't actually uh, read or write. So, let's get into this. Let's show you the solution. Um, it involves my contact with Radioddity. So, what I'm doing here is I'm plugging in my radio, um, just doing just regular stuff. This is what you're supposed to be able to do. Just connect it, no trouble. Um, I double check my connection because I know this is a problem. This is a brand new radio. I just got it from Radioddity. So obviously I filmed it a little while ago because you guys know that I got a, a new radio from them a, a, probably a couple months back at this rate. So now what I'm going to do is double check my device port or device um, settings, device manager in Windows and make sure I'm connected to the proper port. Uh, it probably is defaulting to the proper port. So I just like to know, and this is probably a common habit for you know those of you experienced with connecting radios to your computer. Um, so I just double check that. And then I'm going to read from the radio, which involves um, selecting read and then turning the radio on. Now it tries to read, it goes into transmit. See that red light at the top of the radio? And I also got a power surge onto the USB port. Um, very, very, very uh, interesting event, but it did happen and it did happen multiple times as I tried this. So what I did is I reached out to Radioddity. Um, as you guys know, I work with them uh, on these radios. You know, I, they provide me a radio, I do these videos, but I'm doing this to help out you, my fellow hams and everybody interested in this radio. So they sent me a PDF file and I followed the directions exactly and it updated my driver. So what had happened is Windows 10 overwrote the driver that came on the cable. And so through this process, you update the driver. And you, <clears throat> at that point, I was able to connect the radio without it going into transmit, but I wasn't able to uh, read or write to the radio. So what this involved was guessing the next steps. And guess what those were? Common Windows solution. Uninstall the, so the, the computer programming software, restart the computer, reinstall the software, and then turn your radio on. I mean, you, yeah, connect it, turn the radio on. Go through the normal process, and it worked normally. So um, there you go. Reading, no transmit. The green light blinking is an indication that the programming cable is connected and the data is being transferred. So whether it's reading or writing, it should be a green light blinking. And you can see my programming is in there and I'm all set. So now I just want you to keep in mind that um, this worked for me. It ideally will work for you, but please take the step to reinstall the software after you've, re after you've updated or backdated, at this, in this case, the driver. Um, I know it's a huge pain in the butt, but I feel like having this radio is very worthwhile. So you, it's, it was worth a step for me. And grand total, time-wise, it took me about five to 10 minutes to do this. And then I was using the programming software successfully and normally without the radio going to transmit. All right, thank you everybody, for especially Everybody, the recent subscribers, um, I've never seen such quick growth on my channel, so really, really appreciate it. I'm glad you guys like the radio reviews and the in-depth instruction that I'm trying to provide. Uh, always love the feedback. If I can do it better, please let me know. Um, and also, if you feel like supporting the channel uh, monetarily, you can go to Buy Me a Cup of Coffee on Backcountry Radio. I'll post a link in the description below. But, uh, I, I mean, you don't have to. Don't feel obligated, but always appreciated. So... Uh, thanks again for watching, and we'll catch you down the trail. Backcountry Amateur Radio.